That's just a charge my sticking tab, but I wonder what I should do today. I know. I'll do a review. Well, let's go do a review. I got to think of a movie, though. Anyways, I got two. Ugh. <sighs> hey guys, so very B13 here. Woo, the crowd is fun. Anyways, um, welcome back to my Godzilla movie reviews. Today, we will be reviewing Godzilla 2000. <laughs> this movie, and guess what? Anyways, this movie is just good, great, and this review might take like a short time because I have all the information from this movie. Anyways, let's begin and get ready to crumble. <laughs> oh my god, Godzilla's gonna do this! <laughs> okay, guys, say so over there. Um, so today we'll be talking about how good this movie is for the first place. I'm <clears throat> I like the way, like, just, the movie's fantastic. I like the way they just, just first start off the movie talking about, the well, the little girl's nose about Godzilla, which is just amazing. I'm amazed. <clears throat> and, like, like, there's this guy in the watchtower. You look, you see Godzilla's yellow eye. How cool is that? And right at the beginning of the movie, you just see him destroying stuff already. I mean, what the heck is going on? <laughs> I mean, just, you're seeing all, all of the stuff around the place just getting destroyed. And it's all happening in the beginning. I mean, what the heck? And also, Orga, who's the monster at the end. Guess what? First, this ginormous rock, and then a ship, and then a ginormous squid thing, and then a monster Orga. I mean, what the heck is going on? <laughs> and guess what? His mouth just goes like, and then Godzilla just walks in, and he just breathes a stick of fire. Orga just explodes, and then you look at him in the fire, he's just like a piece of stone, and then you just fall him. Yes, the movie's very good. That's my exclaiming for the movie. So, now for number two. Oh my god, Godzilla! <laughs> ah! Messed that one up on my part. Okay, so, now for my number two. Um, huh. SpongeBob. SpongeBob. Okay, anyway, of course, number four, number... Two, I'm going to be saying about how the designs of Godzilla and Orga is. Well, but I'm going to first start off with Orga because he has some weird designs. Um, Orga, um, he doesn't really look at, like the way he should when he's like a ship. He kind of looks like an original kind. I mean, I knew this movie was like made like in 2000 so something years. Not sure. Stick and distracting. Okay, yes, so I'm back. Um, sorry. Um, of course, of course, the designs of Orca, like, it's kind of like original bits, but still it's awesome. Godzilla's design, a very stunning design, like it's an SOS, kind of. Um, also, just like, it's always just like, you're just watching a piece of stone fighting. <laughs> I'm just saying. Anyways, now to number three. Oh my god, Godzilla's coming up! <laughs> okay, now for my final guess. Um, um how it tells, like, a, a story. Like, how the movie, like, tells a story. Like, a part of the Godzilla series. I mean... <clears throat> Godzilla 2000 was like in two movies. Godzilla 2000, his own movie, and Godzilla vs. Megaguirus. Which really upsets me. 
upsets me because I really want him to be in like other movies. I mean, just that's gonna be that would be really nice to see. Of course, just you know, life is life. <laughs> yeah, it's just like. Look, you see, he breathes out this kind of a fire. Oh, yeah, there's, like, the subtitles I'm going to read after this. Um, see, look, not blue fire, just normal fire. Wow. That really does say something, doesn't it? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Um, okay, so that's my final guess. Now to the subtitles. Oh my god, that's a look at Fail my <laughs> part. Why am I still cutting this? Wait, don't cut it, don't cut it! Thank you. Okay, would you stop cutting it? No. Could you cut? Could you stop cutting it? No. <laughs> Okay. Anyways, time for the subtitles. Um, hmm, what to read? Uh, yeah. the king of all monsters is back, and bigger than ever when the UFO reveals itself as a as an, a massive alien monster with. Awesome destructive powers. So that's the subtitles for the back, and of course, special features. <laughs> that sounds like something. And guess what, guys? Right after this f review, I'm gonna do a Godzilla's Ideas episode. Yay! Anyways, guys. So, of course, like just to say, I'm not going to play as Megalon because he's too slow in the game. So, the next video I'm going to be playing as, um, I think, Mechagodzilla, yeah. Maybe, I think I might have to play as Destroyer or somebody, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this movie review. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and comment down below if you have watched this movie before. And tell me in the comments below if you've ever, um, if you saw any of your thoughts didn't get into this, um, just let me know in the comments below. Maybe if I, like, do something with this movie again on, like, a video, I might choose yours. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe, please, and leave the comment, like I said. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye-bye. And high five. Boom!